asking the question, what's the best weapon in Battlefield 1? And this question is always asked with any new game that comes out. Well, in Battlefield 1, there isn't really a definitive best weapon and it really does rely on your preferred class and playstyle. What I will do though is give you my personal favourite weapons for each class. The assault weapon that I ended up liking really surprised me. During the alpha and the beta the two main choices for me were the MP18 and the Automatico and I do still love these guns. The Automatico is a fantastic weapon up close and I will still use it in certain situations but the main weapon I was drawn to in the final build of the game was the Hellriga 1915. Now now luckily there's only one variant of it so you need not worry about which one to pick and it seems to be one of the later unlocks in the assault class. What's great about the Hell Eagle is that it's got a massive magazine for a start, 60 bullets which is enough to take down multiple enemies without reloading. It doesn't have as fast a firing rate as say something like the Automatico but what does? The thing I love about the Hell Regal is it's hip fire, it's accurate up close and it's got solid accuracy when you aim down the sight. I find it to be just the most versatile weapon in the assault class overall, good accuracy, decent hip fire and a large magazine ticks all the boxes for me. What about Medic then? Well during the beta I personally loved the Self Slayer. It was easily my favourite gun but now after playing the final game I fell in love with the Autoloader 8.25, specifically the extended version. There are three versions here, the Extended, the Marksman and the Factory. The Extended gives you way more ammo in your magazine, which I love at the expense of some accuracy. The upside is you get more control, so the gun overall is a bit easier to fire. If you prefer more accurate fire, then maybe the Marksman version is for you, but I personally just couldn't live without the extra bullets because that's what made this gun just so good. I found that I could hold down an area and just accurately tap down on multiple enemies. Land a headshot and a couple of body shots and you can kill someone pretty fast. I just have so much fun with this gun because it meant that I could get up close with a medic and not feel as though I was at a big disadvantage. For someone who wants to play the objective but still play as a medic, this gun is perfect. Okay, so how about support? Well, for me, it's got to be the BAR M1918. Now, it does have one main issue compared to some of the other support weapons. It's got a really small magazine, only 20 bullets, in fact. If you compare that to something like the MG15 Suppressive, which has 200 bullets, you can see that that's somewhat of a weak aspect, but there's just something so awesome and versatile about the BAR. I think it's somewhat of a nostalgia thing, but I'm fine with that. It's a really enjoyable gun to use, and it's very accurate. I was using the Storm variant, which essentially has a little less recoil. The Trench version will have better hip fire, and there's also a telescopic version, but honestly, I just didn't like how far it zoomed in. It does give you a bipod, though, and better accuracy, but it works best when you're stationary, and I personally just like to be a bit more on the move. Now saving the best till last, this is probably my favourite gun in the game right now and it's in the scout class, the Martini Henry. This probably isn't the most versatile sniper rifle, it doesn't have the biggest magazine or the fastest reload, but what this has in abundance is character, and oh my word that sound that it makes is incredible. The damage this thing can do is just, well, it's bordering on illegal. It can do 100 damage up to certain ranges, and even then it will still do 90 plus. I found myself trying out lots of the other sniper rifles, but in the end I always came back to this one. It doesn't have a long range scope like the others, but the sound it makes when it fires like a musket, it was just too much to be without. If I had to pick a gun as my favourite in the game right now, or one that stood out the most, it would easily be the Martini. It will take some time to unlock in the final game though, as it's one of the last unlocks in the Scout class, but I've got a feeling it will definitely be worth it. The Martini Henry is an absolute beast. And that's all for today guys, I hope you enjoyed this look into some of my favourite weapons in Battlefield 1. Thanks for watching guys, come check out more at youtube.com slash jackfrags. Once again, cheers for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one.